Hi, my name is Misty Soriano, and this is a story about how I came to know Christ. Um, before coming to know Christ, uh, I would say my life was pretty good. You know, I grew up with a great family. Uh, they took care of us, very loving, very warm. Before I became a Christian, I went to church a few years with my parents, but any other exposure that I had to to Christ and to, to faith was with my grandparents through their church. They were uh, Pentecostal pastors, and so I got exposed, whether it was through my family or through my grandparents. But everything was great until maybe high school. Things started to change internally for me. I started to grow very anxious and worry and develop a, f a fear of what's to come. And that started because of all the talk about Y2K and walking through the grocery stores and seeing those rag bags about how uh, the end of the world is coming. And so one day I asked my grandma, who I trusted very much as a very godly woman, if she thought the world could end. And she said, yeah, I can see Christ coming back at any point. And not understanding the context and not knowing you know, what all that meant and not asking more questions, I developed a fear of God. And I developed a fear of him wanting to harm people. And why would he want to take away something that's so good? So throughout my high school and my early college years, I lived day to day in this fear with this anxiety of the end. And I just didn't know how to get rid of that. As I went off to college, I was introduced to a roommate who was a part of a college ministry. And she hounded me every week to go with her, and I just refused. And finally, in the last semester of my freshman year, I went with her, and I thought they were crazy. I thought it was a cult, and I just, it was just, blew me away at how happy everyone was, and how friendly and inviting, and all of this stuff. They were so excited, and so I didn't go back. But the following summer, after my freshman year, it got harder. My grandma died, and I just grew more and more anxious with what was going on and just not knowing how to escape it. I told myself, if I just got back to college and I go to this ministry, I'll get better. And so I did, and I met someone, and she invited me to a fall retreat. And at this retreat, uh, we, ha we did a passion walk or passion play out in the woods. And it was nighttime, and we're sitting in this field, and we just had some downtime. And I just had this overwhelming urge to pray and pray to God. And so I did, and I just prayed, Lord, I can't, I can't do this anymore. I can't live in fear every day. I can't be anxious. I can't be afraid of what's gonna come. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I prayed this prayer and I told God I couldn't do it anymore without him. That I just, I couldn't see how to, to work my way out of it. And so as I closed that prayer, I looked up to the night sky so many stars, and literally in s slow motion, there was a shooting star across the sky. And it was just crazy because the night nice sky is what brought me peace, no matter what. And so in that moment, he answered my prayer. <laughs> and from that day forward, I was changed. Like, it was a physical transformation. I had no more fear, no more anxiety. I was not afraid to do things I was once afraid to do. And it was just, it was unbelievable. I had this confidence and more so, I had this peace. And I came a believer in sophomore year of college. It's been 20 years and that hasn't changed. I still have this peace and this certainty of knowing that no matter what's going on in my life, what's going on in this world, no matter how crazy it be, it's all gonna work out. God's already won. And so that gives you a different perspective and it gives you a peace and a calm and a, an ability to see through and see past all that. And I think so many people are missing that when you don't know Christ. I can't explain it. I can't explain the peace and the joy and the hope that I have now, but I know it's better. And not only has, I, has it taken away my anxieties and my fears, it's given me the confidence to do things I've never done. Being involved in ministry, going on mission trips, domestic and broad, and just being with people in everyday life. So my life with Christ has been great. My life before Christ was good, but it was even better after accepting Christ. My name is Misty Soriano, and Jesus is my Lord.